welcome back everyone so today in this video i will be sharing eight best chrome extension that you should start using right now because this will be increasing the productivity and it will be helpful in many different ways so without any delay let's quickly get started so the first extension added in the list is the web chat gpt and you can see that it says web chat gpt with internet access so this free extension add relevant web result to your prompt to chat gpt for more accurate and up-to-date conversation so you can come to google and you can search for web chat gpt you can click on add to chrome click add extension and then you have to log in with the same user account then click on the puzzle icon at the right in top and do not forget to click on the spin icon so that it can be displayed over here okay so in order to use it simply you will have to click on this chat gpt web chat gpt icon and it will be coming up like this and now in order to use it you just need to type the forward slash command and then type your query top 5 telecom services and if i hit the enter key it will be understanding the question and now it will give me the updated result and you can see that i did not mention the date but still it shows me the trend dominating the telecommunication industry in 2023 include so it gave me the latest information of 2023 so the people who are dependent on chat gpt now who frequently use the chat gpt they must install this extension okay now next we have the unhook that remove the youtube recommended videos so if you want to increase the productivity if you want to focus on any of your topic and you don't want to be get distracted then you must go ahead and enjoy this free extension and you can see around 60 90 people they have given five star of rating so this free extension will be removing your youtube distraction including the recommended sidebar end screen video suggestion user comment home page related videos feed many more things let's see that how you have to use it and how exactly it work so once you come up here you have to click on add to chrome then click on add extension once added click on the puzzle icon and click on the pin icon so that it can be enabled you can see this red icon here now and it says unhook is off so you will simply have to click on this power icon and these are the things that will be disabled so it says hide home feed hide video sidebar hide recommended hide live chat so in case if you want to enable any of them then you can enable it the rest it will all be disabled even if you want to hide the comment then you can enable this option and now this time if i go to youtube and then if i reload the page so you will find that this is a neat and clean page now i'm not getting any kind of recommendation even if i uh, reload it nothing neat and clean page so if you want that you should only see the content on youtube that you manually search like if i click on and i search for any kind of query so you can see i'm only getting the suggestion of the videos that i personally i manually uh, searched so if i click on any of the video so you won't see any kind of suggestion coming on the right hand side on the left hand side okay even i won't be getting the comment because many people they get distracted after reading the comment they spend like one or two minutes just in the comment this is a very useful in case if you just want to enjoy the youtube without any kind of distraction okay so now our next extension is also related to youtube that is clickbait remover for youtube so this extension replaces thumbnail with the frame from the video effectively removing any clickbait while still showing a high quality thumbnail on so you can still get a good idea of what the video is all about okay so once you come up here you can search this on the google then you have to click on add to chrome then click add extension once added click on the pin icon so that it can be enabled so now if you click on this icon here it says start of the video middle of the video what exactly you want to see as the thumbnail image okay just to find out that what video is all about so now if i go back and reload the page so you will see that i'm not seeing any kind of thumbnail and i'm seeing the thumbnail of inside the video the actual video thumbnail that is inside the video okay so this can be really useful for you instead of falling in the thumbnail uh clickbait you can find out what actually that video contain so this is a free extension you must go ahead and enjoy it okay so now our next extension is the speed test by okla 
Now, many time people have the trouble with the internet connectivity. They feel that you are getting the low internet speed or the high ping. Then you can quickly find out by just making a quick result. Okay, so what you have to do, you need to search a speed test extension. Then you have to click on add to Chrome, add extension. Once added, click on the pin icon to enable it. So now anytime if you have the problem and you want to know your actual speed, then you can click on this speed test icon then click on go and now it will be live testing your internet speed along with the ping that what kind of ping you're getting what kind of download speed you're getting just with one single click okay so now next extension is the work owner spaces in the tab manager so if you work on multiple tab and different kind of projects so you can categorize them by just using this free extension okay so let's see how this exactly work so once you come up here you have to click on add to chrome click add extension so once the extension get installed again click on the puzzle icon and then you have to click on the pin icon in front of the work owner extension will be enabled here you will have to simply click on it then it will ask you the permission so you will have to click on allow and then you will have to just uh, sign in with your google account i have already signed in so it is not asking me but if you come for the first time then you will have to sign up with your any of your email or the google account so once you see this kind of page, simply click on this open Vercona. And this kind of page dashboard will be coming up. Now in order to categorize your extension. So let's say if I do the YouTube research. So I will select all the tab related to my YouTube research. And then I will just drag this where it says drag here to create. I will drag it. Now it will ask me that what kind of a space name you want to give. So I will type YouTube research. And then if I want to add someone, then I will simply type their email here. Then I can give the permission of edit or just view and then click on create a space. And let's say that you have another project of like research. So I will just select it. Then I will drag this to a new space and then I will do like just research news. Okay. If you want to give any kind of description, you can give that description as well. Click on create a space. So now we have created two different space and that space is being displayed over here. Okay, so in case even if I close my Chrome browser, the next time if you open it, simply you will have to open the Vercona tab. You will find your spaces that you have created and if you click on it, you will find all your Chrome tab open over here. So this extension will surely help you to organize your tab in Google Chrome and even help you to recover the tab that get accidentally closed. Okay, so now our next extension is the uBlock origin and around 10 million people are using right now. And you can see the rating around 4.80 star rating has been given by like 27, 430 people. And I'm sure that you might have heard about this or you might be using this extension which is very useful to block all kind of advertisement. So it's very simple to use. Simply you will have to come to their extension. You will have to click on add to Chrome then click on add extension. Once it will be added then you don't have to do anything much. Simply start using your browser, your Chrome and you will not be getting any kind of advertisement. Okay and now we have the extension especially for the laptop user. Many laptop users have the complaint that they are not getting the too much of sound from their laptop due to which they are not able to enjoy the movie without the headphone or they have a lot of complaint about it. So if you want to boost the volume of your laptop, then you can use this free extension by the name volume booster. It's very easy to use. Once you come up here, you have to click on add to Chrome, click add extension. Once it will be added, click on the puzzle icon, just click on the pin icon in front of the volume booster. And the next time when you will enjoy any kind of music, you will have to click on this extension. Then you can increase the volume from here. Okay, this is really useful for the people who want to increase the volume and this work absolutely perfect. I have already tested it. So now our last extension is the node board extension. That is a sticky note app and it can be really useful for you because many of the people they are enjoying it. You can see that they have got around 5 star of rating from 7564 people. So once you come up here, simply click on add to Chrome, then click on add extension. Once it get added, click on the puzzle icon again, then you have to enable the pin icon. And once you see this on the display, simply you will have to click on it. 
and now here you will find the noteboard extension icon and if you click on it you will get this kind of dashboard and you get a lot of option here you can find different kind of board here okay so let's say in board one if you want to add any kind of note then you have to click on this pencil icon at the right hand corner click on the plus icon and this kind of you know like a sticky note will be up now you get many different options here you can make a note you can make it bold you can make it italic you can insert any kind of link that can redirect to any kind of different page and once you are done you simply have to click on accept and all the changes will be saved so this is how you can save it for different kind of board you can make all kind of your note with this free chrome extension and that's all guys for today hopefully you enjoyed all these chrome extensions and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe let me know in the comment section which extension you like the most and i see you in the next video Bye bye